going to go on guitar E and your hair I might and this one has quickly become one of my favorites from E and Dior a cool uh, medley there as well we are set our capo hair really high on the eighth fret to match up the sound and have this great high notes so put your capo there on eighth fret and let's start with the chords so that first chord will be a minor so that is open a second D second G first B and open E all right the second chord will be F major 7 sus 2 long name there pretty easy to take so that is third on D string open G first B and open E and the final chord will be a C but with a G in the bass so that is third on E string third on A second on D open G first B and open E yeah so these are the chords now let's look at the melody first and it's based upon of course these chords and this chord progression and the chord progression will be A minor to F major 7 sus 2 and then F major 7 sus 2 again and then you end with the C slash G chord there All right so A minor F F C G so let's start with A minor and the notes there uh, the A minor part sounds like this All right so that is open A second D back to open A and open E top three All right then you're gonna play the next parts based on the F major 7 like that and that is first fret on the E string and the bass together with the open G like this and then a break and then you hit the first fret B string so first fret on the E string together with the open G and you have a pause there and then first B that's the F major 7 first part of it and then you're gonna play a second F major 7 and that comes now and this part sounds like this like this okay so that is first fret on E string in the bass then you're gonna play the open G then back to first fret E and first fret B so four notes there and then you're gonna end with the C G chord there and this part sounds like this okay so that is third fret on the E string in the bass together with the second fret the D string go back to the third fret E string again and play that one and then second fret D string and you end with the open D string so the CG chord was third fret E together with second fret D then third E second D and open D all right so the melody goes like this one round a little bit slower than the standard tempo I believe the standard tempo be something like this and so on all right 
Now, we can also use a strumming pattern for this song. And it's of course based on the same chord, the chord progression A minor F, F, C, G. So here we need to think as a pair of chords, uh, like we usually do in E and your songs, most of them. So we will look at the transition here from the A minor to the F, okay? So the A minor part sounds like this. And that's it. So that was down, down, up, clap. Right, and then you shift to the F chord here, F major seven, sus two, and play this part. Okay, so that was down, down, clap, down. So, down, clap, down. So you have a break there after the first down on the F part. So. So together, a little bit slower, it sounds like this from A minor to F. Right. And then it will be the same pattern, but for the next two chords, which are the F major 7 to the C, G. And notice here that this X, F major 7, now you need to play that one with the strumming pattern, same as you play for the A minor. So that, that means you will play down, down, up, clap for this second F major seven. And you play the down, down, clap, down for the C, G chord. So that will sound like this. That is the strumming pattern. I will give you a couple of rounds of this one. So let's go from the A minor. and yours I might so I hope you enjoy this tutorial if you did let me know give me some feedback and some love perhaps if you like this one so see you soon guys and don't forget play tuned <laughs>